Um, I think the potential for women in leadership positions is huge, especially the next few decades, because women represent a huge talent pool. They're very smart. They're getting more college degrees than ever before. They're getting all the top grades. And in a world that needs the best talent, I think people are now waking up and saying women represent a huge talent pool. So I think the next couple of decades should be the decades of women, where women are invited more into the workplace uh, because they've earned the right to be in the workplace. But all of the barriers that existed in the workplace will start to disappear because women will be integrated more and more into places of work. Um, you know, this book was really talking about the arc of my life and the big lessons that come away from it. And I think if you want to talk about just one lesson, it's that uh, women have to be taken seriously as a talent pool. And women are also family creators. And therefore, it's very important that we give women and young family builders support to have children. At the same time, make it easy for women to be in paid work, which means building a care infrastructure, giving them paid leave, and giving them flexibility you know, at work so they can uh, you know, work from home or come to the office. And so uh, you know, my book is a plea to policymakers to say, think of women as a potent workforce and do all that's required to support them to be family builders too, because we need children to you know, keep the population growing, to take care of the aged, whatever. So let's try to make both happen. Coming to the Emirates Literature Festival has been sort of exciting because I've heard so much about it. I wanted to come last year because everybody was talking about this Lit Fest and I'm glad you invited me again this year because I get an opportunity to see why everybody thinks it's one of the greatest Lit Fests in the world.